is good, YouTube family. It's your boy Rashad, and we are back again. Got another video. Yo, Street Fighter 6. It's time, baby. So, check this out. I got access to, they had a second closed beta. Now, some people might actually be salty about the way this went down with me because I got access to the first closed beta and the second closed beta. But the second time, I didn't really have a whole lot of time to play. Like, I actually had a lot of stuff going on. Like, this whole freaking... They basically give you access over the weekend. And I have so much stuff going on because I, like, I have all these certifications that I already have. And in order to maintain them, I need credits. So I had to, like, take all this training and all this stuff and get all these credits. And I was doing that all weekend. Since time is of the essence, I could have like maybe waited a little longer and just played the beta, but I was like, man, I didn't want to wait, man. Couldn't risk it. So I didn't really get much of a chance to play. But I did play a little bit. Did play a little bit. Man, it was... Look, I ain't gonna lie, y'all. It's free. It was free. Like, I was trying to do training and just play. But people just kept challenging me. So I was like, all right, fine. I'll play. And man, they got bodied. I mean, none of them were good. Look. I'm going to just go ahead and show you all this gameplay so y'all can just kind of see some matches. So y'all can see what my skill level is like. I will be taking the game a lot more serious once it finally releases or if they have another closed beta, which they probably will since the game will come out to like June. So I'm going to just show you all the matches. I'm going to kind of get some commentary over the top of it. Before we get started, be sure to like and subscribe to the channel. Hit the notification bell. Follow me on social media. All of that Let's get into it. All right, guys, so I just went ahead and started recording like literally in the middle of this match. So I didn't really know what the heck I was doing. I was trying to practice like combos and like literally just learn how to do some basic combos because when the first beta came out, like the first closed beta came out, I was, man, what was that? I didn't really know what I was doing, so I just kind of tried to use old combos from like Street Fighter 4. And obviously that, it sort of works, but not really, you know? But lucky for me, like none of the people I played really knew what the heck they were doing. Like, you know, I just got hit by that. You know, I mean, that this is kind of just me somewhat sandbagging, somewhat just trying to like learn. I'd imagine that my opponent's trying to do the same thing. So trying to discredit or anything, you know? but I'm just calling it how it is. So, like I pretty much, for the most part, just use fundamentals to beat anybody that I played that was supposed to be a super and I screwed up. So, because he, he would have been dead. I can't remember if I was in this match or not. Um, I just did a random super there. I'm not really sure what I was thinking. So, I think this is one of the, the, like, the rounds that I lose, but I'm pretty sure I win this this actual match. Like, out of this whole thing, I'm pretty sure I only lost like once. And that is not, oh, okay, well I guess I did win. But <laughs> so I did like lose a match somewhere in here, but it was only like one time. So it's not me like editing it out or anything. Uh, I'm pretty sure that if I would have went, this was non-ranked. If I would have went to rank, then I'm sure the opponents would have been like a little bit tougher. Uh, so, you know, I, what I decided to do in the middle of these matches is since I knew the opponent wasn't like too good, I was like, okay, maybe I can just try some stuff like in the middle of the match and just kind of like learn the timing for basic links and whatnot. So, you know, like crouching light kick and a standing light punch into her little pinwheel kick. I've never really been good at doing that, at least not since Street Fighter 4. In Street Fighter 5, I really sucked at it and I dropped Jury pretty fast, but she wasn't that great in that game, but in this game, she seems like she's legit, so I'm definitely going to kind of stick with her. Um, so, yeah, I'm surprised that Chun Li can't, like, get over fireballs with that. She's literally, like, hovering in the air. Uh, but, you know, it's all good. So, yeah, I was kind of feeling this opponent out. Like, I, do, I actually do, for anybody who doesn't know, I play, I used to play, like, a lot of fighting games. So, I got, like, you know, the general fundamentals for most fighting games down and, like, learning what opponents are kind of like, likely to do, like, everybody around a certain skill level tends to have, like, a certain pattern that they like to, to use and certain moves that they just kind of just have to keep using over and over again, same type of tactics. So, I already kind of know, like, what to do even against an opponent is that it's like, 
you know, even when, in a game where I don't really know the move. And at this point, I figure I was like, okay, I'm about to win time over as long as I stay away from him. And I'm good, so that's why I just backed up there. Eventually, this guy just quit. Anyway, um, I can't remember if it was three or four matches. So they were, I mean, this is definitely, I think this might have been like the easiest opponent. I don't know if it was this guy or if it was like the, like the next one, because there, I think there's only like three opponents that I'm gonna be playing here, and one of them was like mashing the hell out of some buttons. Like they were just pressing buttons all freaking day. Like it didn't make no freaking sense. It kind of looks like I'm doing that, but I'm I'm trying to strategically block at moments where I know that they can actually fight back. So yeah, here I'm I'm trying to get them to jump and see if I can anti-air them. That's why I keep doing the fireball. See, there's the anti-air. So. It works like 99% 90, of the time, even against good players, that works. So, I did that because I figured they were pressing buttons. And dead as fuck! Ugh, I already knew. I just knew they would press a button. So, I was like, you know what? I don't mind scrubbing this out. Like, that is like the scrubbiest thing ever. Like, oh, I'm just random super. Yes, I know it's horrible, but hey, sometimes it works, fam. So, you're really not supposed to do that. You're really supposed to kind of like use it in the middle of combos or unless you're just really really sure that your opponent is gonna like do something reckless and you just you just know it all your heart is gonna work <laughs> which sometimes you can be wrong but uh if you just really feel like it's gonna work then sure you could do random super i've seen people do it in big big tournaments and and finals of tournaments and all sorts of stuff and sometimes it works and sometimes the opponent blocks it and that's game over you know second place you know good job uh, making it to second <laughs> so but anyway um yeah this this is pretty much like me just kind of again trying to get them to jump but my reaction speed was slow so i didn't do any anti-air there so i'm, I'm basically kind of just rinsing repeating trying to like build my own muscle memory to get the anti-air in when I do the fireball, but I'm trying not to like just throw them over and over again because I obviously know the opponent can just jump over me. And you know, of course I wouldn't get hit by that. I think I got hit by like a bunch of those. And I don't use mine too often because I know that the opponent can kind of counteract it. You know, they they can use their own. Uh, I forget what these freaking things are called. So sorry guys for not remembering the terminology. So I know that that's a, a big bonus for anybody who wants to know the terminology to help learn it. But I'm not like great at that sort of stuff. I just know how to play the freaking game somewhat. Do anti airs and you know, you know, do different moves that take up space, like control kind of general space. So another time over. One of the reasons we keep getting time over is because. It seems like a lot of people kind of just keep like running away from me. <laughs> like instead of trying to fight, they're like, I don't know, they're, they're trying to figure out what to do. And I'm not just like blindly approaching because I get hit more often that way. So I'm like, you know what? If they just want to just hang out over there all day, then I'll just chill. Unless I like get really annoyed and frustrated, then I'm not just going to just run up. Just run up and just get done up, you know what I'm saying? So. I'm over here kind of chilling, and we're getting all these time overs, which shouldn't be happening. But I, in general, I will say that I do love to play aggressively. I play Laura in Street Fighter 5, so don't everybody thumbs down me all at once for that. But Laura was bait. You know, I'm hoping that they put her in Street Fighter 6. So far, it's not really looking like it, but they need to. You know, because Laura was, she was just really freaking good. She has some very interesting and cheap stuff. So it, it just makes her kind of an interesting character. Like, especially like all the grabbing and stuff. And I never really was like a character. I never really liked using grappler type characters, but Laura was an obvious exception. She had fireball and all this stuff. So, yeah, see, I countered. I was waiting for him to do that in the corner. And I finally got the super off. Yes. Finally got my level three. I was waiting for it. I wanted to finish him with that. <laughs> oh man, that was nasty. Okay, I think the dude finally took that. I think that's the last one. Is that the last one? We're gonna see. Okay, yeah, he's leaving. Alright, next up was this dude playing Ken. I believe, if I'm not mistaken, this is the dude who was just mashing a hell of a ton of buttons. I mean, he actually, like, 
I think knew some basic combos. I don't I don't know, like I don't really remember, but I remember I was getting hit a lot and it's because I wasn't expecting him to just keep pressing stuff. And he just he definitely just always challenged. Like he he was he's a challenger. Like he always is gonna challenge you when he's not supposed to. You know, eventually I figured that out and I was like, okay, like I can definitely just out button this guy. <laughs> it's just you know, just time my button presses properly. So definitely like pr probably these po folks. It's probably the first time playing the beta. So just as an FYI, I literally only played this for like an hour total of play time. So I had access to the beta the whole weekend. I played this much for like an hour. So I kind of kind of space this guy on that round. Uh, so. I didn't get a whole lot of chance to practice or anything, so don't think like I was like practicing behind the scenes. Um, I think you would be able to see, if I'm not mistaken, I think you'd be able to see my rank right then. I hit him with super here. Massive damage! So, I think you'd be able to see my rank or something. I mean, I didn't know how to finish the combo. I don't really know like all the punishing optimal combos yet, so that's why you, know, you don't see me doing like extremely damaging combos, but you know, I, I, I do a thing or two. Um, right there, I'm, I was trying to do the cancel, like you do the crouching uh, mid kick, and then you dash forward, and then you, you know, do a, you can do a basically a full combo. It's like kind of broken, <laughs> but I, I like it. I did learn that, like right before this match, I think. So I cut out the training part because I was training for like a solid, I don't know, five minutes or something, trying to like learn this combo. Uh, I'm pretty sure at some point, I think like, I don't think I get a chance to do it against this guy. I think I do it against the next guy. Uh, so you, you guys will see it. You know, if you stick around, you'll see the combo eventually. So I'm not proficient enough to where you're going to see it like over and over again at this point. Because again, I didn't really practice long. But, you know, this is just, you know, this is just me playing. And just kind of giving some, some move to hand. So, okay. Yeah, I'm pretty sure the dude actually wins this one, so yeah, he got that one, though, but he doesn't win any actual matches, that's, I'll tell you that, that, that does not happen, so, uh, it's really not until the, the next opponent where things kind of turn up a little bit, but admittedly, even that guy wasn't, like, particularly good, I, I pretty much watched everybody, um, in, you know, in these matches, and it was already kind of late, like, I was playing this, I was playing this pretty freaking so I pretty much had to get ready for bed. I had to like shave and get ready for bed by the time I played this anyway. Uh, so that's one of the reasons as well why I didn't really have a chance to do anything with this uh, beta. I'm kinda sad about it. Uh, hopefully they do like a third uh, closed beta or even an open beta so more people can play. Oh yeah, I countered him with the super there. I can't remember if I did that on purpose or not. I felt like he was gonna counterattack. So I, I knew he was gonna press it, but ow. Oh man, that was bad. <laughs> oh man, how'd I L pace? Okay, I'm pretty sure that, you know, that's it for this guy. So yeah, he's done. He's done. Alright. Last match, well, last opponent, Zero Striker. So Zero Striker was decent. I mean, he was better than the last two guys, okay? He actually knew, you know, some basic combos, but very easily discernible patterns. So, you know, I mean, you can kind of see I actually started taking my time against this opponent instead of just kind of, you know, blindly doing more stuff. But he, he wasn't, he still wasn't, like, difficult. I just kind of, in, in, for, in all fairness, I mean, again, people are trying out different characters. Jury is pretty much the main character that I've been using, so I didn't really put much time in anybody except for like Jury and a little bit of Chun Li in the first phase. Oh man, okay. Washed. <laughs> oh man, look, I ain't gonna lie, even though these opponents weren't that good, it still was satisfying to go ahead and get these W's, you know what I'm saying? Like, I can't even cap, it was satisfying. And I, I keep trying to do the freaking uh, light pinwheel. I don't know if y'all are catching that, but I keep like trying to do like light attacks into the light pinwheel, but I keep screwing it up because you have to kind of put, input that motion kind of fast on a controller. I'm not using a fight stick. 
and it's just kind of a hard and difficult to put, so it's just not working. See, okay, see there, I'm trying to do the, I'm trying to do the combo that I was telling y'all about, and I messed up the timing, so of course he's gonna mess up the timing on the super. Oh man, okay, and then I, I knew he was gonna do that, so and then I tried the super again. Yes, sir. <laughs> Oh man, see, I got better at this without even playing. That's the thing that's cool. Because the first time I played the, the beta, I wouldn't have. I wouldn't have worked. I think I lose this round because I didn't like know how to counterattack. See, that last hit killed me. The last hit of that kill. Um, but, you know, I, I think I pretty much already spoiled like how the match has been. So, <laughs> you know, um, I do like end up losing like one of these matches. Awesome. Kind of went brain dead on that round. You know, just kind of just went in, but that's not what's gonna happen this round. <laughs> so here we go. Yes, sir. Okay, I, I still mess. I still didn't finish the combo, but I was one step closer. It's, it's good to try it mid match. Okay, we're both pretty much out of meter. You guys can see that. So well, his is recharging. Mine is. <laughs> okay, there it goes. Okay, he just did his. It looks like a super. I don't know. Was that a super or a DX? I, I, I couldn't. I don't know. Okay, he's about to be dead. He can still super me because he fell on a fireball. Like an idiot and died. I'll take that. Yeah, it, it's got to feel embarrassing to like just fall on a fireball. Especially when that low to the ground. But whatever. So I accept that outcome. So I'm pretty sure me and this guy do the same thing at the beginning of every round. We pretty much, I try to get Jerry's charge killed. You know, and he tries to get his ring off uh, every time at the beginning. And I don't know, eventually I started taking advantage of that. I can't remember. I think I feel like he never tried to take advantage <laughs> of, of me. Oh, he's he's got some of the cancel too. Uh-oh. Okay, this round is not going good. Give me the hand. And you see the way he's moving back and forth, he's feeling himself. Ugh. Ugh. Yes, sir. It's not over yet. It's not over yet, son. Okay, he might hit me right here. Okay, yeah, he did a C. He did a C. I pretty, is that a C? I keep missing if he has meter or not, so I don't know if that's a super or not, but I'm pretty sure it went through my attack, so I'm pretty sure that's a super. Um that's the only way it'll like it'll like go through that. But okay. But yeah, like uh, and he apparently Jamie has pretty decent uh, Maybe some anti-air like just you know just jump in the air and catch you in the air because that he hit me with that move a couple times just catching me jumping hit me with like this weird double kick thing and i yeah okay this takes up like massive damage massive damage so definitely i mean they, they have no v triggers in this game but like like look at all that damage okay he should be done damn it i messed up Okay, this dummy attacked and at the wrong time, but... Okay, I won. Sure, I'm pretty sure I won. Yeah, that's it. I got it with the grab. Got it with the panic grab. I'm pretty sure that was a panic grab. Like, I didn't know what else to do, but I felt like he was going to try to block. So I was like, okay, let me just, just hurry up and grab and hope for the best. If so, you like, woke up with some lessons or something, I probably would have lost. But he was too scared to do that. That's one of the key things here. You gotta, you gotta scare, you gotta instill that fear into him. Um, you know? Yeah, see, that move is good. He does, he does that a lot, that little jumping, jumping move. See, I started using the pinwheel, the anti-air, and to try to try to scare him a little bit. Of course, that way. I feel like he hits me with like another level. Okay, I hit him with another level. Never mind. Fall alarm. Ah, the saddest. All right, so a dub for Jerry. So jumping back into another one. So we play, we play a couple of these. So this is the last guy that I play. So we play a couple of these. I mean, neither one of us is that great. So I'm not saying just because I beat them that I was like. This, this master opponent like we're all new to the game and for all I know this is like his secondary or his third character or something you know so I really don't know 
I wasn't around long enough to find out, but we did play uh, quite a few matches. We played like at least like six or seven matches, me and this guy. So, you know, I was pretty determined to get like a decent set in with somebody, but to be honest with you, I really was just trying to practice combos. I wasn't, like, they kept challenging me, you know, so I just wanted to practice combos. Okay, so. I wish that I, like, my timing for like the supers and stuff is not good. That's why you see me just drop so much. That's why I, why I said I was trying to be practicing. See, and I messed up. See, he should have been dead. And I'm pretty sure I, I, I might end up losing him. He should have been dead. Okay. I end up. Um, but yeah, see, I have a lot of opportunity. But, you know, just the muscle memory is not there. I'm not quite as quick as I used to be. I, okay, wake up, pinwheel kick. See, that anti air didn't work at all, but that's why you, you just gotta use the pinwheel kick. But hers kind of sucks sometimes because, like, the opponent can, like, jump over it awkwardly, and then you're just sitting there looking stupid, and you're open for, like, a massive punish. So. But yeah, I feel like Jamie could be a problem in, like, the wrong. Well, the right hands, I guess. And it, one of the things I like, it seems like these characters so far are seeming like decently balanced. I don't know how it's going to look when, oh wow, seriously. I mean, I guess that was good timing. Uh, but I don't know how it's going to look when the actual game uh, releases. Uh, you know, in terms of the other characters, yeah, he definitely But this round. But uh, yeah, I don't know how it's going to look when the rest of the game in characters release, but at least these eight characters, they seem pretty balanced. I mean, Guile's still kind of cheap, like, I don't know what they're thinking. It's like every time they turn around, it's like more ways to use Sonic Boom. And I'm like, what the hell? <laughs> like, why does there need to be like more Sonic Boom? Like, there's enough Sonic Boom, period. There's, it doesn't need to be more freaking Sonic Boom options available for Guile. Like, yo, you can shoot him diagonally now. I'm like, no. Stop it with the freaking Sonic Boom. Okay, he's dead. Wow, I missed no way. And all I'm here. Okay, well, at least I didn't allow him a chance to come back. Because if he was, like, really good, then he could have come. I was like, I thought I was going to hit him. I can't remember how these matches went. So, I mean, this was yesterday. So, I know, like... I know I get like a, a bunch in a row and the guy pretty much plays until he gets like at least one. Uh, but the thing that's good about that is he doesn't quit after he gets his one. So he doesn't kind of like take that one and then leave. So, but I know that I'm not taking full advantage. Like Jury has a lot of, she kind of has a lot of range. She's kind of cheap. So, so I'm not really taking full advantage of her range. But you know, it's all good because my objective wasn't really like it wasn't really just to like beat my opponent. It was to try to do certain combos and see I messed it up right there. Um, yeah, but you know, I was trying to get in the Oh wow. I, I didn't even know you could combo like that. I remember I was kinda surprised when he did it <laughs> in the middle of the match. I'm surprised looking back at it too. So it might be something if I ever try Jamie out that I you know, pay pay attention to. But look, they put Laura in this game, Jury might get dropped. Jury, I'm pretty sure, between her and Chun-Li, probably gonna end up being my main. I don't know, we'll see how those other characters, because I was kind of upset, I was kind of sad you couldn't play, like, the other characters that they recently announced. You know, I figured since they announced them, and they announced the beta, literally, you know, the second closed beta after that, that they would, uh, you know, allow you to play as those characters. But, alas, uh, it was the same characters from before. So, you know, nothing, nothing special. Okay, this is gonna almost kill me. I'm pretty sure I still win this match. But, wow, look how much that... Okay, yeah, he, yeah, he, tried to, he tried to trick me, but I knew... I knew, I knew he was gonna try that move. You gotta be careful near the corner because all their opponents are looking for that. So, pro tip for anybody who plays this: like every, everybody's, every, anybody, anytime somebody's in the corner, it's all, it's like you're almost waiting for your opponent to try that. Move. So, I don't know, you might have to like try comboing into it. I don't know if there's, I don't know if you can stop it if, you, if somebody tries to combo into it. Like, I don't know. I haven't, I don't have enough experience with it yet, so. Uh oh, getting closer. 
Get closer. I, mean, I got my level three. Okay. Yeah, she, oh, she. Okay, that that's the one he took. So. Yeah. Next. Look, don't be getting all cocky now. Don't get all cocky now, cause you know I won most. Of you know, in in that that round where he won, like I'm not even trying to just cap. I'm not trying to cap, guys. I promise you. But I really wasn't trying very hard. I wasn't really trying very hard to most of it. You know, because again, I was trying to like learn more rather than win. So, you know, it's a whole different story if I'm just trying to win. I can just use the few moves that I know, and that really should probably be enough to win. Uh, at least against the opponents of this skill. Didn't get a chance to go to rank. I really wish I would have. Hopefully there's another closed beta. Because next year, if there is, <clears throat> I mean, I don't know. I can't think of anything that will hold me back in terms of timing, but we'll see. Depends on when the next one's announced. If they do have another closed beta. Which they definitely should. So... Yeah, and I keep jumping at him. I don't know what I'm thinking of jumping at him. Because he has demonstrated the ability to hurt me <laughs> pretty bad for jumping. Uh, but I don't know. Maybe it's not enough damage. So, like, he doesn't do it. See, he doesn't do it consistently. I think that's why. And I'm going to Oh, wow. Yeah, okay, it's going to hurt. So, that's something I'm going to have to think about. I, I feel like when an opponent doesn't anti-air you consistently, you feel like you can challenge. Okay, I'm not in a good position. Yeah. 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 I think he just kills me with like this. And I should have like pinwheel. I think the pinwheel could be that, but I, it might trade and I might have gotten the best. Uh, I think this round. See, you kept trying to like move forward and like you can't. You just kind of have to block that shit. You can't do nothing when she does her standing. You just, just, just don't either. Either like, I mean, if you could, if you had Ryu or something, you could like charge you or something. Well, I did the, um, I did the the auto correct. That was kind of an accident, but I'll accept that. So, worked out in my favor. So now, yeah, I was trying to hit him with an overhead. I figured he would. I, I haven't used an overhead pretty much like at all, so I figured he was definitely gonna get hit by it. <laughs> I'm trying to do something. I'm trying to make something happen. I just kept trying over here. I knew I was gonna hit him with a trade or something. Like there was, it was gonna be difficult for him to pull that. One. And I made sure. I think we play like one more. I think this is the last one. So I can get my wish streak back going. Okay, boom. Yeah, so he keeps trying. I don't know why he jumped again. Like, I didn't expect, I was like, okay, he's not going to jump again, so now I can approach him on the ground. Ugh, ugh. And see, now I'm getting serious on him. Y'all see what happens when I get serious. Oh, man, I almost had the perfect. Almost had it. Kind of upset. See, I messed up the perfect. I should have had that. That would have been it. But I kind of backed off because I was like, okay, he's got to approach me anyway. I'm not even going to, like do anything to, to jeopardize myself and I secretly like see he tried to do he tried to combo he hit me with that combo before where he anti-airs me like or air to airs or something and then he combos me out like before I hit the ground but he messed it up he messed up the time but yeah I really think I need to use Dury's fireball more in my approach I, I do use it, but I think I need to use it even better. And I can see some areas. Just watching my footage back, I can see some areas. Also. See, I wasn't looking for, I wasn't looking for that that time. This fool just took a drink right into the I knew he was going to do something. Yeah, he's, he's done. I think he quits after that. So I think he's done. That was, that was pretty bad. Is that it or does he? Let's see, I don't know. Okay, he doesn't quit yet. Okay, there's one more. One more. Okay, I'm looking at the video lane. Yeah, it looks like there's enough for one more. He probably wanted to kind of redeem himself because he kind of got wickedy washed in the last round. I would have been upset too. I would have been upset too. Okay. 
I knew he was gonna get hit by that guy. I saw him pressing buttons, so I was like, I'm about to jump over your ass out of this fire ball. I knew he was gonna also not block right there. A lot of people don't block like when they when you get hit, when you block the, the light attacks, you don't expect somebody to just throw the pin roll out too. But the light pinwheel is kinda hard to punish, so and in some cases it's impossible to punish in the space correctly. And some people that you wanna press a button right there. So. You can't always press though. I mean, sometimes you just gotta chill and just block. Yeah, I have this problem too. So I mean, you know, but I'm I know that it's a problem that other people have. Yeah, I mean, I, I messed that up. I mean, that wouldn't work because he blocked anyway. I, I messed it up regardless. Wow, that hit from kind of far. Okay. See, he could combo off of his life too. He probably doesn't really know how. You know, I know how, or, or he's not proficient at it or something. Yeah, he can't really combo. Okay. Oh man, I was trying to finish him with level 3. I think I just finished with some of the shit. This is our destiny. I should have like did my level three after he did his. I see which one would have worked. Massive damage. Okay. I try to do mine because I don't know if it's gonna chip or not. That does no chip. That does none. See, he tried. He tried to do. He tried to like use his DX twice in a row. Like hella desperate, but alas, it wasn't enough. His greatest efforts were not enough to defeat him. So another dub, play a lower shot. You know what I'm saying? So anyway, y'all look. That's it. This is a different, <clears throat> different type of video than I normally make. So, but I mean, this is what I've been doing. It hasn't been like besides the stuff I told y'all about, like with um, with the certification and stuff. That's pretty much what I've been doing like most of the weekend. So there wasn't a whole lot of time to like record or do anything like that. But I did play this for about an hour. And I caught some bodies, some dubs. Okay, so I holla at your boy. I mean, not the greatest opponents, but look, a W is a W. So look, I appreciate y'all watching. Look, I'm gonna um, get up out of here. It's gonna be some more stuff coming before Christmas. Um, I'm gonna try to do a live probably Thursday. So probably no Rayman this Thursday. I'm gonna do something else. Y'all gonna see, you know, y'all gonna see what I'm gonna do. Uh, what's today Monday today this video should release on Monday so um, I don't know what I'm gonna get out between now and then but we're gonna try to get some other stuff out I'm definitely doing something Thursday and I'm gonna try to have something ready for y'all by Christmas I'm gonna try it. it's gonna be tough because I'm thinking something kind of big but we gonna see anyway y'all look we out of here I appreciate y'all rocking with me staying to the end if y'all stay to the end Y'all a real one? Leave down in the comments, I'm a real one. If you heard this message, let me know that you're a real one, okay? Be sure to like the video. Subscribe if you're new. You follow me on Twitter, twitter.com slash Rashad Lamar. should be a link for that somewhere. Appreciate y'all watching. I'll catch y'all next time. Peace.